Let's start with Joshua Kelly. He's Chargers fourth round draft pick. Um, a guy played at UCLA, also at UC Davis. Tons of production in college when he's healthy. Yeah, I think the injury history is a little bit of a concern on Kelly, which is probably why he was still available so late. But this is a guy that's built up some college production and, and certainly is intriguing. As you mentioned, he transferred from UC Davis, so it tells you it's not a guy that's afraid of competition and he wants to compete. And you can see that when you watch some of his film. Yeah, let's watch the film. Um, the big thing I like about this, I love a guy that can catch. And we talked about it a season ago with like Joshua Jacobs from Alabama. The way that he's able to contort his body to catch the football is not a thing that most running backs are willing to do or comfortable doing. And, and fairly or unfairly, Melvin Gordon, who was with the Chargers, were sort of, sort of tagged with that inability to catch the rock. And I think that's what this kid's going to be able to give you uh, as a little bit of an upgrade. I mean, here we see it. He gets slipped out. You get the motion inside to run low interference. And the tight end creates a natural rub. Now, all of a sudden, he's wide open. He can take it to the crib. This is going to be the element of which they try to exploit is his ability to catch the balls that are off target. He's a natural catcher. And then once he gets it, the ability to put the foot in the ground and get north will be an asset for the Chargers. Well, let's talk foot in the ground. Um, I love this. This is, this is vision. This is athleticism. This is a setup. This is one recognizing that the play goes left. It's a front side play. He doesn't like what he sees there. What do I look on the backside? Okay, they've got a free runner. I have to take care of that free runner if I'm the running back. And what do I do? Give you a leg, take it away. Now I'm going, now I'm running, you know, take, take, getting us right in scoring position. My good friend, Howard Griffith, former Super Bowl winner with Denver Broncos, always says good running backs run with their eyes. And that's what you see here. He's running with his eyes. He saw was clogged up in the middle, no problem. I'll just bounce this out, hit the perimeter, and then put the Skittles on the safety who's coming down. Make him miss in space. Here's a Skittles right there. Run through. He's rarely tackled by the first defender. And then, of course, he knows what to do with the ball. And so this is a guy that, you know, he, he, he's not flawless because we know that, you know, you want to see a little bit more juice, a little bit more linear speed, but certainly a guy that I think that can help contribute if you find him in the right system. 